worship and honor you. We welcome your presence. We stand in this moment to declare that you are the mighty God. For all things created have been made by you, invisible and visible. And yet we stand in a place of awe of why the elders, the 24 elders, why they bow down before you. Because there is no one full of the majesty and might, power, dominion, glory, as you, the Most High God. And so we stand in this moment to declare before all of the forces of darkness and the one who fell, kicked out of heaven, defeated. We declare that Yeshua is Lord. Jesus is Lord. And at the sound of that name, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that you are Lord. You are God, you are King, you are mighty. And we stand in this moment to declare the greatness of who you are, God. All hail King Jesus. We worship you. The greatness of who you are caused Daniel to fall down at thy face before you. John shook in your presence. There is none like you in all of the heavens and all of the earth. We stand in this moment to acknowledge that Jesus, you are Lord, you are our God, and we will serve no other. We believe in our heart that God raised you from the dead, that you are alive. And we confess, we speak with our mouth, that you, you, you are Lord Jesus. And I feel the power, the might of who you are over this nation now. I feel the strength of you over the earth. Now, God, show Show the wicked who shall soon be cut off. Show the evildoers that they cannot defeat you or your agenda. Lord God, David declared we would have despaired, we would have given up, we would have gotten into fear. Unless we have believed to see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Arise. Arise, O oh God. And let your enemies be scattered in this time. I hear you say so clearly, this shall be what you are bringing forth in the earth at this time. The arising of God the arising of his agenda. Swift victories shall be won right after another through the courts of this land. Are you ready for some months of victory? Are you ready to see that the tide has truly turned, says the living God? Are you ready to hear the sound of a war cry that comes from the host of heaven who are warring, warring on my behalf and your behalf, says the living God. Are you ready to hear the sound as it was in the days of Jericho, where walls that seemed impenetrable began to fall? God says the agenda is falling, it's falling, it's falling, it's falling, it's falling. And you're going to see it. 
you're going to hear about it. God says, watch what I do to a media who has been filled with lies, deceit, narratives that have affected the mindsets of many. But God says, listen, they will have to report now the victories that shall come one right after another. And yes, there will be fires. Yes, there will be backlash. But God says, pay it no attention because greater shall be my plan of how I bring this nation back into reset and order. You have heard and you have known that Rome fell in a day. Keep your eyes upon the Vatican. For I'm going to shake, expose, and cause a stirring that shall bring international and national attention. Because nothing shall stand before me that will not be shaken in this time. Pray. Pray through your summer and through your fall. Because God says those who have sought to take your freedoms and bring harshness to this nation fears what they know without a diversion a midterm miracle to mend the mess but listen 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 They know without mayhem, they will not win. So they are devising plans through your summer and through your fall to even delay your midterms and bring chaos to this country. But God says, listen carefully. How would they succeed? What would they do this time? Even though victory shall be seen and identified through the outcome of the different places where men shall vote. They shall seek to create diversions, violence. God says some shall even seek and cooperate with the spirits of divination to call up from the waters your gulf, your east coast, to create storms and men in their ignorance would say, yes, God arises to judge again. Must you be reminded that I was asleep in a boat and the spirits over the waters sought to kill, to create a diversion to stop what I said, we will go to the other side. And I speak and I say to you, there is a miracle that is in my plan. But there is disruptions by the hands of the enemy that must be stopped. That mayhem will not prevail. That storms would not arise at the time of your midterms to bring great disaster.
that shall create fear, sorrow, distractions, and for the counsel of the ignorant to arise and say we must delay, we must divert the assembling of the votes of the land. Shall you arise, my watchmen, at this time and say to the forces of darkness, you will not arise, you shall not succeed. Shall my watchmen arise as I rebuked my disciples and said, where is your faith? Many are complaining. Many are looking at the things in the natural and have been pulled from faith. I speak these things to you now so you may pray through your summer and your fall and break the power of mayhem, disaster, destruction, diversion, delay, chaos, violence, and bring a miracle that shall mend the mess. You say, God, what are you waiting for? Is it the votes? Your votes are not enough. You must watch. You must pray. You must decree. And you must bind and loose. I look for my church to prevail. Thank you, Lord. Wow, the presence of the Lord. I think we need to act on what he just said. I need somebody to help me because I cannot move my feet. I am serious. I'm not one that's weird, please. If you think that's who I am at this moment, you've insulted me and you've insulted God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I need, a, I need somebody to pray with me right now. Who, who is? Thank you, Lord. 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 Let's begin to lift up our voice in the spirit. Father, we pray through the summer. We pray through the fall. We say, let there be a great fall. The fall of the wicked. The fall of the evil agenda of those who think that they can steal, kill, and destroy this nation and harm innocent people. We proclaim whatever is bound upon earth shall be bound in the heavens. We bind every demon power. We bind every Satan agenda. We rebuke those who have come to steal, kill, and destroy. We cancel their agenda. We cancel their assignment. Whatsoever is loosed upon this earth shall be loosed out of the heavens. We loose the Holy Ghost, the Spirit of Truth. The we loose, we loose, we loose we lose the spirit of truth. We lose the divine intervention of God himself across this nation. We lose the host. We assign the host under the command of the Lord of hosts himself. Rise up, Lord of hosts. Rise up, Lord of hosts. Rise up, Lord of hosts. Rise up. Rise up, up hosts under the command Excel in strength, shred every satanic agenda to create mayhem, to create storms. We speak peace over the weather, peace over the Gulf, peace over the Atlantic, peace to every storm. We break the power of divination. We rebuke the spirit of voodoo, sorcery, 
Ile Makatea, Resika, Rabataya, beyond this fire, Ite Rus Nebakuma. Come on, Mase, you that are watching, you that are here, pray in the Holy Ghost. Nikite Rosuta, Mataya, beyond the Sakia, Ite Nekota. Mandaya, 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 Mia Kotale Kata, Vitora Bosaya, Vitora Bosaya, Rasekea. We call upon the arrow of the Lord's deliverance. Deliver us from evil. Deliver us from satanic plots and agenda. Deliver our midterm elections from diversions, delays, chaos, violence. Deliver us from evil, Lord God. May the truth prevail. May the truth prevail. May there be integrity in our elections that will be upheld, that will stand in this land. Oh God. Oh God, we cry out for the sake of the people. God, they've had enough. The harshness of this season. Rise up with compassion. Rise up with mercy. Mercy, mercy. Let us see your mercy. Oh God, your undeserved, unmerited favor that rises above all the evil that's happening at this time. Show your arm of mercy, your hand, your arm that is not so short that it cannot save us. Bring a midterm miracle. Bring a midterm miracle to mend the mess as you have said. Bring it! Bring it! We call it in the earth. We call it into manifestation. And no matter how much maneuvering, no matter how much thievery, no matter how much deception, it will not be enough, we pray. Oh God, Abakadeva Sedea Resekia, Usebrusta, Mandaya Miandosea, Itanabakaya Tea, Shuka, Ma! I speak peace, peace in the realm of the spirit. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Anybody else? We'd like to pray. Man, how many of you feel, God, something is happening? And I could care less what the devil thinks or any religious demon could think right now. We are going to take America back. We are going to take our midterms back. We're going to cast the devil and his devices out of this nation. And may the Lord God of hosts prevail. Thank you, Lord. 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 You heard God's heart. You heard his secrets. Who can stand against you, God? I dare them to try. Anybody want to pray over the midterm? You have something, Brenda? You want to pray over the midterm? Do you want to pray over this? Huh? But before we pray, yeah. I got to tell you what Thank I, you, Lord. while we were praying. 